hi my loves so I'm back with another tutorial and this one is gonna be holiday inspired with the bold lip and all so the first thing that I'm doing here is moisturizing my face I never do this in my videos well I only have like one video but <laughs> but my skin has been kind of dry lately so that's why I'm doing this step then I'm gonna prime my eyelids using this I can't stop laughing uh, this concealer by Urban Decay uh, I'm just doing the step to prime my eyelids for the shadows it's to prevent creasing and um, to prevent your eyelids from getting oily throughout the day and then I'm gonna set this with this kind of white nudish shade and that's just gonna like uh, use it. it's gonna be like a base for your eyeshadows you know what I mean so then I'm gonna use this peachy toned shade it's gonna be my first shade and it's gonna be my transition color I'm just gonna put this up there on the crease not really in the crease but like the upper crease you know like kind of towards the brow bone you know what I mean well I'm just showing you then I'm gonna take this orangey looking color I, they don't have names so this is really hard for me but yeah so I'm using that shade and I'm gonna apply that in the crease and I am using all Morphe brushes and I am using the Morphe 35O palette I don't know if I mentioned that or not then I'm gonna take this like burnt orange and I'm gonna apply that in the crease as well but kind of lower than that shade that I applied before then I'm gonna take this like red orange and apply that in the crease as well I'm taking a lot of shades y'all so I'm sorry I just I didn't know what I was going for at first so I just started applying colors so then I'm gonna take this like burgundy color no it's not burgundy what the fuck I'm talking about but um sorry excuse my language I know my niece watches my videos but um it's a very like it's not a brown brown but it's kind of like a dark red color I don't know how to explain it but yeah I'm just blending that out with this brush I switch brushes by the way and then I'm gonna take this brown shade and I'm gonna use that to smoke out the eye now that really is a brown shade I'm just gonna smoke out the eye with this shade and then I'm going back I think but the other brushes yeah to just like blend 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 because blending is key then I'm just gonna apply concealer to the area what where, where uh, to the area where I didn't apply any shadows because I'm gonna apply a loose pigment and I want it to have something to grab onto. You know what I mean? So that's why I'm doing this. And I'm just gonna blend it out with my finger. And the pigment that I'm gonna be using today is by MAC and it's in the shade vanilla. And I sprayed my little brush with some spray I don't even remember which one it is and then yeah I'm just gonna apply this with my little synthetic brush so then I'm just gonna retouch all the shades to make sure they didn't lose their pigment you know I mean even though I didn't like do nothing to it but I just wanted to retouch it <laughs> Then I'm gonna, uh, whatever, apply my wing. Now I'm gonna be using the NYC liquid eyeliner and the number 857, I believe. And I just love how this wing came out. Thank God, because I thought I was gonna mess up, like, for real, for real. Because for some reason, sometimes my wings, when I'm nervous, they don't come out good. And I was nervous recording this video because I haven't recorded in so long. And then I'm just gonna sharpen my wing using this concealer, the same concealer that I use on my eyelids. Then I'm gonna prime using the Benefit Professional. And this is like my holy grail, I swear. I love this because I have like big pores like on my cheeks and stuff and on my nose. And it like really helps smoothen out my face. And then I'm gonna take the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Foundation, I believe. 
And I'm just gonna dot this all over my face. Then I'm gonna take my damp beauty blender and blend it all over my face. So the next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna conceal and highlight the under eye, the forehead, the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow, and my chin. And I did that. <laughs> my nose came out crooked, y'all. Oh my god. Then the next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bake or set this using my RCMA no color powder. I'm just gonna apply this under my eye. Then I'm gonna sharpen my nose like I did right there. On my forehead and then I'm just gonna contour using this. I don't even know what contour thing this is. But yeah, I'm just gonna contour my nose. I mean, dang, my cheekbones then my forehead, and then my nose. Then here I'm just baking the nose, uh, carving my contour, and that's it. And my chin, applying that on my chin and around right there my mouth. Then I'm just gonna brush off the bakers on my forehead, my nose, my under eye. Then I'm going to take this brow powder and retouch my brows because after all the bakage or whatever, it kind of loses their color. So I'm just going to take the darker color on the outer part of my brow and then I'm going to take the lighter shade on the inner part of my brow. Then I'm just going to set my brows using this brow set thing. <laughs> this brow gel, I meant. Sorry, my bad. Then I'm going to take this uh, blush that I got in Mexico when I was down there and I'm going apply to that, apply that on my cheekbones. Then I'm going to take this e.l.f. baked blush. That's what it is, but I use it as a highlighter. Um, I don't know who would use it as a blush because I wouldn't because it's like just shimmer. But then I'm going to apply it on my nose and then on my cupid's bow. The bridge of my nose as well, sorry. And then I'm going to take these lashes by Dep Makeup. It, they're in the style thickness. These are like, oh my god, so gorgeous and so long and so full. Then here I'm just applying mascara. And then I'm just going to finish this look applying uh, American Doll, I think, I believe. By Anastasia Beverly Hills. Then for the final step, I'm gonna set everything in place with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Thank you so much for watching and until next time.